Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of nanomaterials. Specifically, we're going to talk about reduced graphene oxide, or RGO. If you've heard about graphene, the wonder material, then RGO is its slightly altered cousin. So, let's get started. Before we dive into the detail, don't forget to like and subscribe our channel. We need your support to create more informational content like this. First things first, let's quickly recap what graphene is. Graphene is a single layer of carbon atoms arranged in a hexagonal lattice. It's super strong, lightweight, and an excellent conductor of electricity and heat. Basically, it's the superstar of the nanomaterial world. Now, graphene oxide is a derivative of graphene. It's made by oxidizing graphite, which is the same material you find in your pencil lead. Graphene oxide has a layered structure with oxygen-containing functional groups attached to the carbon lattice. This makes it water-soluble and easier to process than pristine graphene. So, what happens when we reduce graphene oxide? We get reduced graphene oxide, or RGO. Reduction involves removing some of those oxygen-containing groups from the graphene oxide, converting it closer to pristine graphene. This process improves its electrical conductivity and mechanical properties while maintaining some of its processability. If you want to try this material, you can buy it from our website. The product link is given in the description section. Reduced graphene. Oxide inherits many of graphene's remarkable properties. It's incredibly strong, flexible, and lightweight. Plus, it's an excellent conductor of electricity and heat. But what makes RGO even more intriguing is its versatility. It can be used in various applications, from energy storage devices like batteries and supercapacitors to sensors, electronics, and even in biomedical applications. Let's talk about some cool applications of RGO. In the energy sector, RGO can enhance the performance of batteries and supercapacitors, making them charge faster and last longer. In electronics, it can be used to make flexible and transparent conductive films. Moreover, its high surface area makes it ideal for sensors to detect gases, chemicals, and even biological molecules. In medicine, RGO can be used for drug delivery, imaging, and tissue engineering due to its biocompatibility. So there you have it, folks. Reduced graphene. Oxide is a remarkable material with a wide range of applications. Its unique properties and versatility make it a hot topic in the world of nanotechnology. Whether it's improving our gadgets, enhancing energy storage, or advancing medical treatments, RGO is paving the way for exciting innovations. If you found this video interesting, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more fascinating insights into the world of science and technology. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye everyone. Stay curious and keep exploring.